I'm Andy Gupp with the USRI Developer Network team and today we're going to cover Business Analyst Desktop, specifically two items, the Map Series Report and the Project Explorer. The Map Series Report lets you quickly produce map views of multiple areas and convert them into presentation quality reports or images. The Project Explorer, which is a new data management tool, lets you easily retrieve all layers associated with the project. So what did I do? I interviewed Kyle Watson. He's the product engineer for the Business Analyst Desktop team. Let's jump over and see what Kyle has to say. Well, I would like to focus on some reporting functionality that we've added at Business Analyst 9.3 show the map series report that we've added and also show how you can quickly create a report from the Project Explorer, which could definitely save you some time. So to give you a little background on the map series report, we've added it to kind of solve the problem. Let's say you've got 3,000 locations around the United States, maybe they're franchise locations. You've got a 30-minute drive time around every one of them, and this will allow you to instantaneously produce a report or a set of images for each single location and produce them right away. Great, let's see what you got. All right. So what I've got right here is a set of trade areas, five of them around the southeastern Michigan area, and we want to create a report for each one of these areas. So create me a report here, 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 and then spit it off in either a a bitmap image or a JPEG image or just a Crystal Reports, Reports Viewer, maybe a PDF, could be anything. We'll go to the Business Analyst menu to Reports and we'll step through the wizards to get to the Create a Report from Current Map Layout wizard. And here at night 2 you can just create a map uh, or a report of the map extent. Well we've taken that a step further now you can do multiple ones. So here we'll say use our drop down menu and click drive times which is available in the table of contents and that's our layer that we want to create the reports from and here we can choose the title that's going to go on the actual report so here we'll do city so that'll appear up here as a report title and then here there's different options of how you're going to create it but we want to group them by a field, so we want to make sure that all of the areas are included in the report instead of just an individual report for every single uh, drive time uh, section as you go out. Then here you also have other options here to say export the image uh, or the map as an image file such as JPEGs or bitmaps or TIFFs so you can just readily pop them into PowerPoint. So I'll click next now, we'll create the report, click finish and we'll start executing. All right, so what we're looking at now is Crystal Reports Viewer that's gonna show each individual trade area on its own page, your own report. So right here you can see we've got the ESRI logo, we chose uh, the report title, and it's basically produced it in a presentation quality report as you would see in Business Analyst. And if I go to the next one, to the next one, to the next one, you can see it just basically just zooms to each trade area, gets the outermost boundary, and then produces that, that report from that report image. Now, if you wanted to create an image file alone, you didn't want all this surrounding area, you would just choose that option to go right to an image, such as a, a bitmap or a JPEG. And like I said, that can go into PowerPoint, and it's very easy to share. So now what I'll do is take that in another direction to say if I've got all of these trade areas and I want to make a quick demographic report off of these, you know, I don't want to go through the wizards and, and bury myself in there just very quickly, almost like a, a favorite or a bookmark on the web is right click in the Project Explorer, select the trade area that I'm looking at here and say create report. So here, for each drive time that I showed in my map series report, I've gone in and very quickly ripped off a demographic and income report. And I can set this in the business analyst preferences. It doesn't have to necessarily be this one, but this is technically my favorite report. And then I can come into each of the trade areas and look 
on each page, how they've differed, all the demographics in here. It's a standard summary report available in Business Analyst, and it's also available in graphical form 